my channel. So today is going to be a little different because I had a situation last night. So today's video is going to be a kind of learning experience for all of us. Um, if you are a man, you might want to just mute out unless you have a daughter. Um, if you're younger, you, you might not just want to, you might want to not watch this video is what I'm saying. It's going to get a little bit I'm gonna say graphic in my detail as to why I'm doing this video. So it's about tampons. Needless to say, I don't have um, a reason not to wear them, I guess, until last night. So last night, I haven't been on my period for a couple of days. So normally I don't wear pads, I usually wear tampons. So I actually have, I'm gonna show you guys what I currently have. This one is Playtex Ultra, and I have, because I'm not a brand snob, I used to be just Playtex, and then Tampax, um, these are Super Plus. So they're about the same size, almost, absorbency wise is a little different, obviously. So until recently, these used to be cardboard, the Tampax, they used to be cardboard. And now they're in plastic and Playtex I've always liked because they've always been in plastic. So it's a little easier to like insert. So Ultra, this one is going to be a Playtex and this one's going to be the Tampax. Okay. So last night, I'm going to do a side by side with these. Last night, I had this feeling down below and I was like, it was just a weird feeling. I'm not going to go into too many details. I'm not going to show you what happened or anything like that. So I went to the bathroom and I wiped and I'm like, I looked because I have a feeling and you guys, female eyes, know what the feeling is. It's like just a, just a feeling. So anyways, have this feeling, I wipe, I look and it's like the beginning or ending of a period type of color of like mucusy blood type stuff, right? Mind you, I haven't had my period for like two days or so. So I'm like, what the F? What the F? So fresh paper towel or fresh tissue, toilet paper, wipe again. And this time there's like something in it and it's not a clot. I told you guys, this is going to get kind of a little graphic. It's not a blood clot. Like, you know, when you have that issue, it literally, and I, I'm going to just be, you guys, I was confused last night. So I have this toilet paper and this folded up, literally it was like a little square, like about that, folded up little wad. And I'm like, what is this? So me, still sitting on the toilet, I like touch it because I was confused. So I told you guys this is kind of nasty. I unfold it, it literally covered like this whole area. Like I still have the toilet paper on there it literally covered this whole area of my palm, like a sticky note size. Right, is that about a sticky note? Like a regular sticky note? So here I am going through, what is a tampon made out of? I did purchase organic tampons before, and I'm thinking to myself, this is the only thing that it could have been was like something of a tampon. So just by looking at the pictures of on the box, how this one opens up like this, like spreads up, you guys see this? So it opens like a little flower kind of cup. And then this one opens up like this. So it's kind of flat, like the whole tampon flattens out and widens up. So I'm thinking it's gonna be this brand. I'm gonna open each of these. And I don't have hair attached to it and do a water test. And I can guarantee that this Tampax one is probably what's inside of me because literally, or was inside of me, I'm freaking out because like, what the F? And I don't know how it would have, okay, so see how they're put together? Like a little string, this is a Tampax one. So if this opens up, this is literally what was inside of me. I don't even have to do a whole test. It looked like this first top layer, but with mucusy on it. Like 
period on it. Literally, it detached itself from this tampon. And this is what was inside of me. You guys, I just solved the mystery. Because it looked like plastic. And when this is wet, I can guarantee it probably looks a little more plasticky. And it kind of feels plasticky. This is what this was. This was, can't even the size was sticking out. This is what I unfolded, was this layer that's on top of the cotton. You guys just solved this mystery with me. It's like we're the Scooby clan. Like this, but twice the size, was what was inside of me. Tampax Pro. Guess who is going to go straight back to using... So then if that layer is not on there, this whole thing just falls apart then. Where did I throw it? Guess who's going back to using, we're going to open up the, okay, I understand like little fibers. I can understand that. So this one, or it could have been this one, who knows? All right, hold on. This one literally. This one's totally different. Like I said, this one opens up like a flower. All right. Okay, guys. Actually, I need... Oh. This one's more cotton than the other one. Okay, so this one opens up like this. Now that we all know what tampon looks like, if they're held together. how this is uh -uh. this doesn't have a a plastic lining so I'm glad you guys helped me with this this was what was inside of me was this plastic lining so I google searched this plastic lining this thing came off of the Tampax tampon Tampax Pearl this came off of one of my tampons inside of me while I'm minding my own business and stayed inside of me, guys. Stayed inside of me. So, Playtex all the way. I have not seen, I don't see any kind of, like, it's all cotton. Unless it literally breaks apart and whatnot in front of me. But this is more, holy shit. These guys are getting commented. I'm commenting, I'm going to email these people. So I was freaking out last night and then did my own personal swab and found that there was nothing else in there. But I'm going to contact these guys. I was trying to find the ingredients. Instructions. Well, no shit. Everybody knows how to use a tampon. If you don't, I guess I can do a video of how you... I won't do a video. Um, uh, cotton, rayon, polyester polyester is what's like in my workout pants some shit that I can't pronounce something else that I can't pronounce and fiber finishes guys this literally was what was inside of me if this would have stayed inside of me I could have had toxic shock syndrome which I know you guys are all like saying like it's on the boxes it tells you if that would have stayed inside of me I could have had like a blood disease or bacterial infection all sorts of stuff if you google search it just tells you like da -da -da -da, what could happen do you see this i can't even get well now i get it to pull apart because i've been playing with it this has no plastic in this that i'm aware of it's probably got this thing is so ridiculous ingredients rayon which is the same thing that that has Cotton fiber, polyester, cotton string. So just like food, you've got to know what you're putting in your body. So apparently, was a good deal. Tampax was a good purchase. Versus getting the same absorbency in Playtex. But Playtex has never screwed me over like Tampax has. And now I have a mess of stuff to clean up. So... I'm going to contact Tampax. If you guys use this and this has ever happened to you, I I want to know in the comments below, but this literally was what was inside of me. Crinkled up. 
and came out. So thankfully my body was working to dispose of that trash out of my body. So leave a comment below if this has ever happened to you. I have had my period since I was age 10. I am 33. So I've had my period for what, 23 years. And I can say 19 or 20 of those years I have used tampons and this was the very first time in my entire life that that has happened to me. And only recently have I switched to starting to use some Tampax. F them, I'm going straight back to Playtex. I want some Tampax tampons, I'll mail these to you. I got a whole box. Um, so, leave me a comment, let me know if it was too, too much for you or not. I guess I don't have to do a water test, I was just taking it apart and I figured it out. So, very disappointing. So, Playtex, yay for the win! Tampax, boo, you've tried to kill me. Um, but I just wanted to post a video and see and make sure everybody's aware of what's going on in their lives. So, thank you for watching. If you did watch, I apologize for just rambling and I, I was just wanted to share. Um, but thank you again. Give me a thumbs up, comment, like, subscribe, share, whatever, because Tampax is getting an email. I wasn't going to do it last night. I was thinking about it. I told my boyfriend, no, I'm not going to do it. But now that I've thought about it and stewed on it all day and it's been almost, or it has been 24 hours, I wanted to know and I wanted, wanted to know for sure why. So Tampax puts stuff in it that you don't know what it is and totally screws up your body. So keep that in mind when you're purchasing for your feminine products. Thank you.